Hey guys, in my most recent video, I mentioned that I would probably make a video showing how to download older versions of Windows 10 from the Windows website. So I thought I would just take a quick minute to show you how to do this. Uh, so let's go ahead and switch camera angles and we'll just jump right into it. Okay, so here we are on my desktop. And the one thing to know about this is you really need to use uh, Microsoft Edge to make this work uh, as quickly and easily as possible here. So you can see that I've got Edge open. Um, I've got their, their download Windows 10 page open here. Um, and, and I'll have a link directly to this page in the description down below. Uh, but the first thing you need to do here, uh, once you're on this page, once it's loaded and ready to go, you're gonna press F12 on your keyboard. Um, so we'll go ahead and press that. And then we're gonna get, uh, we're gonna get this uh, debugging uh, console thing over here. And what we wanna do um, is actually uh, drag it over until we can see an emulation tab. You'll probably come up on, on this elements tab. We really wanna go over to emulation and go ahead and click on that. And then the next thing we wanna do is come over and, and find, here we go. Uh, uh, using agent string. And if you come down here to where it says um, Apple Safari iPad, um, go ahead and click that and the page is gonna reload. Uh, but what you'll notice here is the page changed. Before we had a couple of buttons over here um, to download. Now we've got an option to select an addition. Um, and this is kind of a cool way to do this. So what we can do is actually click that and we can say either the Windows 10 October update or we can go back as far as the April of 2018 update. And this uh, this is the older version that seems to work better for, uh, for what we're trying to do with the Chromebooks anyway. But if you wanted to download um, the older version for another reason, you could definitely do this as well. So you could just go ahead and click that, click confirm. It's gonna take just a second here. Um, you'll go ahead and select what language you want it in. I'm going to select English. You can select whatever version you want. Um, and then you can either download the 32-bit or the 64-bit, uh, whichever you prefer. If you want to download the 64-bit, just click the button, go ahead and click save, and that's it. So it really is just that easy to uh, go over to the Windows website, download the version that you want. In this case, that's the 1803 version that I've had better luck with uh, downloading and using to install on Chromebooks. So there you go. It's really just that simple. You just need um, Microsoft Edge installed, which if you've got Windows 10, you've already got it. So you're good to go there. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. It really is just that simple. If you've got other ideas, comments, whatever, go ahead and leave those in the comment section down below. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thanks for your time, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.